Hi everyone, so this is the first video that I'm filming after my holiday and it's going to be a haul video. It's not anything that I picked up while I was on my holiday because I didn't do any shopping while I was there at all. I went to the mall once and it was only to check out the giant Nordstrom that was there because it's like four levels high I think. So I did check out the mall but I didn't get a single thing which in hindsight probably wasn't my best idea because in the States everything is much cheaper than it is in Canada. So it probably wouldn't have been a bad idea to pick up some things that I've been wanting but um, first of all I went on the holiday to just relax and I didn't really have any intentions of going shopping and second of all I wasn't in a shopping mood but when I got back though I did pick up a few things from a few stores and I'm going to be showing you a few things that I got from Forever 21. I got about four things from Forever 21 so this isn't going to be a very long video. I am loving the color palette in stores right now and I think I Instagrammed a picture with that little caption on it because there's so many just really great colors in stores like a lot of brights and corals and neons and it it just reminds you that spring is around the corner even though it's been very snowy and cold these past few weeks. So yeah, I'm just going to quickly show you the four pieces that I got and I will start with these pants here. This is a really fun bright coral and I don't have any pants in this hue yet so I was really excited for it. Plus the material is super soft. It's like a cotton slash spandex so it's really soft to the touch and really comfortable to wear which I love. So these are skinnies which I like and also so they only reach your ankle which I also like because I find that that's the most flattering pant length for me that way it's not too long and just sits really nicely at my ankle so this is life in progress and I believe it was like chapter 3 skinny jeans um, but I just really love this color that's really what drew me in plus when I tried it on it was so comfortable the next thing is this skirt and I love the skirt first of all for the color I'm still obsessed with mint green anything mint I love that color um, this is almost like a mint green slash turquoisey shade and it's like a jacquard um, print like it's knit the fabric is really light and flowy and that's what I like about it. It also has a lining which is great too and I just love the shape of it. It's kind of like an A-line shape and it's also just really flattering on. It sits nicely at the waist. It's an elastic waistband and it also just flares out really nicely plus the color like I said is really beautiful. The next one is this top here and I love this because of the color and the stripe. It has like that little hint of that emerald green because that is the color of the year. This year for 2013. Um, I got this one in a size larger than I normally get because this is in a medium and I typically get a small but I like that because it's a little bit looser and I find just the fabric doesn't really have too much of a give so it's a lot more comfortable to wear. I really love this style of shirt because it's very thin and lightweight and it's really nice for layering. It only has three quarter sleeves which I like too. So this would be a great shirt to wear with pants. You could even tuck it into pants or even a skirt. So I'm really excited for that. The last thing that I got from Forever 21 is this button-down shirt here. So it's very see-through as you can see there. Um, but I like it again because it's very lightweight. It's easy to layer with. I love the mint green stripes on here. I just love this shirt because it just screams springtime to me. And I actually paired this with the coral pants and it's just a really amazing color combination. So I'm really excited to wear this. I actually want to show you two more things. One is a dress that I got from Winners a few weeks ago. I think like two or three weeks ago. I love this dress for a few reasons. The color is one obviously and I also love the style of it. Last year I really got into into dresses with that collar and the button down look. I also really love the skirt on this because it's an A-line skirt so it's gathered at the waist and then it just flares out and I find that that's the most flattering style for me. It just any any dress that is that style works perfectly for my body shape so I really love this and I also like the back because it's not just like a traditional bracer back or just a plain back. It actually has like a really clean almost like geometric cutout here which is really nice also. The last thing that I want to share with you guys is this skirt that I made and I recently purchased a serger which was kind of a big investment especially since I am not really a seamstress. I'm not a seamstress at all and I will never claim to be one but I've always just been fascinated with how clothes are made and just all that stuff. So I thought it would be really fun to sew myself a garment, like a piece of clothing. So I went with a skirt because I thought that was the most doable for me and this is how it turned out. Um, I got the fabric at, I don't even remember, it was a fabric store and it was, I got this on clearance and the fabric was only like $2 a yard because 
I didn't want to go out and spend like $50 on fabric when I was just testing out the waters. So this was a really inexpensive skirt. Like the material only cost me $4 because I got um, this kind of like chiffon material for $2 a yard and then this um, solid piece for $2 a yard. I thought it turned out very well and I'm pretty proud of myself. It just has a gathered waist and this is an elastic band because I haven't um, entered into the world of zippers yet. And then it's just, it's really simple. It's just a skirt with this little um, chiffon overlay. And yeah, I really love it. I actually have a lot of excess material for making this. So I'm thinking of making another skirt, maybe like something a bit longer um, or like a high-low version of this. So yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I am pretty proud of myself for doing that. That is it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I will see you guys next time. Bye.